Hi everyone. I wanted to do a story time about the time I went and met the Gardens of the Galaxy cast. It must have been two years ago. It was summer of 2014. I'm not sure originally why me and my sister decided to go to the premiere because we'd not been to any film premieres before and I understand it was Marvel so we were very much for the idea but I wasn't sold on Gardens of the Galaxy as a film so I don't know why I wanted to go. I thought the film was going to be a flop, a complete flop. I thought Marvel were making a terrible mistake adapting a really obscure 70s comic with a talking tree and a raccoon. Everyone else was really like hopeful for the film but I was just, I was just sure that it was going to be terrible and I was wrong which is always good. I think we just wanted to go to a film premiere, red carpet. Obviously we don't go watch the film, we just stood on the red carpet. The actual day was <laughs> the morning of it. I was very, very tired and my head hurt because I had been at a house party the night before at my friend Lucy's house and so I'd not really slept and I'd been drinking the night before so I was kind of just like, cool. It didn't help that the one day of summer decided to happen on this day and we had to travel on a train to London. We got on the wrong train <laughs> to start off with. It was fine because it was taking us to the same place but we got on a slower train than we were supposed to so we had to pay another full ticket price which was a lot. I can't remember how much it was at the time. Too much money. But because of this it meant we were going to get to London later than we originally planned to. The extra premiere started about six I think five or six so we'd have plenty of hours before to just chill we had quite a good space we kept moving a lot when we got to Leicester Square it was quite busy when we got there but because it's quite a big area it was spread out so it wasn't as like daunting and crowded we were trying to get like right on the barrier but we couldn't get there because it was already like a line of people but then there wasn't really like a line behind so we were just kind of like stood behind a few people. I remember we stood next to this guy who was cosplayed as the Punisher and he was really annoying but apart from that it's really good. It was really hot. We were stood in the sun for a long time. I was probably really sweaty and everyone could probably smell me but whatever. When the actual celebrities came out, Chris Pratt obviously came out and he was like gorgeous and like charming and everything. I should make a point of that I didn't get anything signed. I only took pictures of them because I wasn't on the barrier so I couldn't get anything signed anyway. And because I was kind of hoping certain Marvel celebrities would make an appearance so I could get their autograph. And the ones who I was hoping for didn't show up. If you know me, you probably know the specific two people that I'm thinking of. And then surprisingly, Chris Hemsworth showed up which I was like, this is a lovely surprise. He's very tall, like I understand he's Thor. He's very, very tall. Most of these people didn't have really like an extended conversation with them because it's kind of like they're signing people in front and I'm just like, hi, I love you. And they're just like, hi. Who else was there? Uh, Dave Batista. Zoe Saldana was there and she was in a really nice dress and she looked really good considering she was pregnant at the time. Oh, I met Stephen Moffat. I'm not even sure why he was there, but I told him he ruined my life and he proceeded to laugh at me. Vin Diesel showed up and he was in an Iron Group shirt and on stilts and walking around shouting I am Groot basically. And at one point he was saying to us, he was like, if I fall on you, you're gonna catch me, right? And we were like, yeah, woo, of course we will. Who else did I see? There was loads of YouTubers there. I don't know why YouTubers always go to the premieres, but I think like Jack Howard was there and like Sprinkle of Glitter. I think Charlie McDonald was there as well. Just all those, that kind of group of people. Joss Whedon showed up. He just had knee surgery. So he had his like stick with him and he wasn't really going to anyone. He was only going to the press to like do his interviews and stuff. That's only the first of two times that I've got very close to Joss Whedon, but not met him. It was a really good day. From it, me and Gemma were like, yeah, we're gonna go to so many more film premieres. And then the next year we decided to go to the Age of Ultron one, which turned out terribly. And that is a story for another day. <laughs> Let me know if you want to hear any more stories. I was trying to think of something that I could do as a story time. I don't think I have a very interesting life. That's all for this video and I will see you in my next one. Bye!